welcome back to another SM16 video. This one is for y'all who are looking for something different. We're going to be doing a Michael Jordan shot. Hey, before we keep going, I would appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel. It took a long time to edit this video, so it's subscribe. But this ain't no regular Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan channel. It's not. We ain't doing any of that easy stuff. Six championships. Uh uh, that's too easy for us. Now, what we're doing is a three peat. You have to get him off your team and then another three peat. So, we have eight years. In the lottery draft, we have to pick a player to be our Michael Jordan. We have to pick a player to be our Michael Jordan. Now, I will create a new My League. We're going to go to current NBA teams. Start in regular season. Now, we're going to set up a fantasy draft. We're going to turn this on. Draft order is going to be on. And yeah. Now I'm going to pick Chicago Bulls. And it's a Michael Jordan challenge. I mean. You have the Chicago Bulls. Michael Jordan challenge. So. It is all set up. And. Yeah. Um, this is all going to be manual for now. The two years. Which I will not be controlling the team. It will be all automatic. Until the off season when I have to sign Michael Jordan to trade for him back. Not Michael Jordan, but the player I choose to be Michael Jordan. Now, a player I choose to be Michael Jordan has to be at least 87 overall. So it can't be someone that's really easy to get. It's to make it a little more challenging. So, yeah, um, I have to get a 3 P, get the player off my team for two years, then do a 3 P again. Um, let's go. This is a draft order. Let's see where I'm picking. I'll have to pick 5th, because I need a player over 87 overall, so, well, I can probably get it, so I'll pick 13, just because that's unlucky, and I'm trying to, yeah, so we're going to simulate to my pick, I'm going to choose my player, um, we have to choose a player, so I have to pick someone young, uh, so young is Carl Anthony Towns, but he's on a 5 year contract. You have to be strategic here. Uh, I could do Paul George, but he is too old. He is too old. So Morty is getting beat. I have to find a player. Bradley Beal. Now that is an intriguing option. Three-year contract. This is perfect. He's an 88 overall. And he's 26 year old. Young. I think I'm going to go with Bradley Beal as my Michael Jordan. Now, our next pick, we are going to choose the best possible team we can get around Michael Jordan. For that, I will have to go with John Wall just because I love the way he plays. And he's on a three-year contract. Perfect. Yes, we're going with John Wall. Next pick, who are we going to pick? Um... We have a point guard showing our backcourt is set. It is set. Um, so, we need a center. Big man to lock things up. Jonas Valanciunas. Pretty intriguing to me. Steven has on a two year contract. Uh, does he have a player option or a team option? Um, let me see. Um, I don't think we can see his contract here, but, um, I'm gonna take, yeah, I'll, I'll take Steven Adams. So, we're gonna pick, pick our next pick. Um, now I need a small forward, because that's the next thing I will need. A small forward, or something like that. We're gonna look at small forwards. Eric Gordon, he's an intriguing prospect, and we can lock him up for five years. Uh, I'll just have to go with Eric Gordon. Yes. 
So he won't be playing with Bradley Beal um, in the last, second repeat, but that is fine. Um, I will be needing a power forward, won't I? I'll pick another center to, and make one of them power forward. Whichever one goes up higher. Um, I'll take... I need a center. So. Brooke Lopez. Just hit a button, Morty. Give me a beat. Morty's getting another beat for us. So, uh, I have my starting five. I have my starting five. Um, and I am going to sim the rest of the draft. No, actually, I'll make picks and I'll see you at the end of the draft. So we're going to load the 2020 draft class real quick. No. We're going to load the 2020 draft class. So this is going to be our roster for 3P number one. We're going to go for a 3P right here. Bradley Beal as our life coach Jordan. And we'll have to build a good team around him. I'm quick at it. These guys. So we're good with Eric Gordon as he is. JJ Redick is fine. Steven Adams. Now let's see. Oh, we will do that. And Brooke Lopez. Just curious. Oh, okay. So let me trade find a Brooke Lopez and find a good center. I'll trade finder and find a good starting caliber center. Uh, we need to win the championship this year. But he won't want to play backup. Um. Kristen Thompson, that would be a downgrade. Um, I could get Kevin Love. Uh, Paul Millsap. Yeah, I think we're going to have to go with Serge Baca. We do give up Mark Gasol, but that's fine. Um, yeah. So I'll do this trade. Um, yeah. Alright. I do realize we're trading a center to get a center, but I need a starting caliber center. The backups can do whatever they want, to be honest. This game is kind of broken, so backups don't matter. So let's look at our rotation as is. Oh, we got John Watt, point guard, um, Bradley Beal, Eric Gordon. I like him at starting small forward because he can shoot. And so far, uh, we have a shooting team. John Watt isn't the best shooter. Um, John Wall doesn't need to be a shooter just because he's such a good slasher and driving in. He's so quick and athletic. I know he's got injured with his 2K. Um, we got Steven Adams and Serge Ibaka down low. And we got JJ Redick as a six man. I like this so far. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and get us another upgrade at center. Uh, I'm going to do the trick that I have in another video. It's going to be in the top right corner if you want to go click on it. I'm going to do that trick with let's do it with Nico Melli. Nicolo Melli, not Nico Melli. Apologies. Not familiar with the NBA this season. I haven't been watching it much tape to admit. Uh I'll give up a second round pick. That is fine. We got um MCW. I'm not doing a full trip. Where you at? Where you at? 79. There we go. Um, let's see what you can fetch us. MCW. Let's see. Robert Covington. Yes, I love this trade. And you'll see why in a second. We do have to give up JJ Reddick and that hurts me. Because I love him as like a coming off the bench guy. So I will look at the rest of these trades. Nothing catches my eye. But you'll see in a minute why I love this trade besides the fact that you have to get up ready. Um just watch this. Yes, that is why I love this trade. So we can now start Robert Covington. Actually I'm gonna trade him because he's a fake 85 overall. Shoot. You know what? Yeah, okay, we're gonna have to keep him. Uh, Eric Gordon can come off the bench then. He can, he'll be a good sixth man for this team. What does it have us? 
Well, we ain't rebuilding, man. We ain't messing around with no rebuilds. Boy, we contending, boy. Just hit a button, Morty. Um, I like this team. I'm gonna simulate to the trade deadline. And I will see you at the trade deadline. Shoot! Shoot! First game of the season. First game of the season. We got a broken hand for Aaron T. I love 2K. I love the way 2K likes doing whatever it likes, whenever it likes. Now I will actually see you at the trade deadline. Okay. So we are at the trade deadline. We are at the trade deadline. And I have to say, I am disappointed. Let's look, look. Third. You have to be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. No, actually we're not at the trade line, but this is where I'm gonna make my trades. So let's go look at our stats. And so our MJ has been doing good, he is not the problem. John Wall has been doing good, he's not the problem. Eric Gordon's been absolutely killing it. He's not the problem. Serge Ibaka has been absolutely destroying it. He is not the problem. JJ Barea has been great for us coming off the bench. It's Steven Adams and Robert Covington where the problems lie. No, Steven Adams is having a good season, averaging double double, but he's not even good enough. So we're going to trade back to him and just see what we can get. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Alright. Okay. I like this one. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think I know what I'm doing. I will be getting my hands on the Marcus Aldridge. Now let me just see his stats real quick. He is doing good. I will be getting my hands on LaMarcus Aldridge. This is a win-win trade for uh, both of us. So, yeah. I will be getting my hands on LaMarcus Aldridge and I will make him play the power forward Just now. Morty is getting us a beat. I will be simulating to the end of the year. Okay, it is the end of the season. Uh, Luca wins MVP just like he normally does. John Morant wins Rookie of the Year, 27 points. Wow. Lou Williams wins Six Man Shirt Trade from. Makes me regret it. Kawhi Leonard, Defensive Player of the Year. Again, Luka Doncic is MVP. We already looked through that. Bam. Um, these are all NBA teams. You can pause it if you want. Pause it, but I'm going through all of it. And, yeah. Uh, we are going to be the three seed. What we can do, we can trade for Derek Rose. Uh, we can trade for Dante Sabonis. Yeah, I think we'll trade for Dante Sabonis. What contract is he on? So what's the contract? Now, four years. Derek Rose on a one year? Nah. So we're going to get our hands on Dante Sabonis. Dante Sabonis. Now, we can give up a pick, but that's fine. We're going to be contending that year. So we're... We are getting Dante Sabonis now. Our roster is already looking better now. Uh, we no longer need LaMarcus Aldridge. So I'm going to trade finder him for a better center. Um, could get DeMarcus Cousins. Um, 
hold on, let's see what I can get. Just gotta look. Just gotta look. Cause no one's offering good stuff for Marcus Aldridge. Could bring Tobias Harrison. Or it could bring Marcus Cousins in. So what the numbers? What did Tobias Harris average? What did Tobias Harris average? He averaged 17. So he averaged 17. So I will be doing this trade. I got Tobias Harris on the squad. Which means we no longer have a need for whoever was a starting spot, but we didn't have one. Okay, so um our roster is looking good. John Wall, Bradley Beal, Tobias Harris, Dante Sabonis, and Serge Ibaka. Oh, he is off the contract. But we can go after Anthony Davis, I believe. What's their solid cap? Oh. Wow. Okay. Well, I will be renouncing all these guys. Is we can now go after. We can now go after Anthony Davis. We can offer him a max, an NTC player option, and he is coming to us. So we are going to get him, but just in case we don't, I will also offer Son Whiteside a contract. But I doubt we will be needing him. Because we got our eyes on. Okay, so he will also come. But we got ourselves Anthony Davis, boys. Got ourselves Anthony Davis, so I am loving this. I am loving this. Um, so we got Anthony Davis on the squad. Uh, I love this roster, to be honest with you. We got, now what happens if I do this? No. So we need to trade Clint Capella or make him a uh, center. Um, I'll make him a center. Okay. Let's go. I'm gonna skip the summer league and go straight to training camps. Um. I will send him to perimeter defense. He did that. He is a guard. Perimeter defense. Mm, Bradley Beal. Okay. Um, so we're gonna advance training camps and let's quick look, see what the perimeter defense went up to. So it went up to a B and that's good to me. Um we're gonna advance the next season. So that is gonna put an end to episode one, one season of the Michael Jordan Challenge, NBA 2K20, the new and revised Michael Jordan Challenge, fun one. And I will see you next Sunday with part two of this Michael Jordan Challenge. See ya, SM16 out.